Luigi. Are you ready to go kart racing? They got this new game where one of us drives in the front and the other one's in the back. It's on the PlayStation. And it's called Crash Bandicoot Double Dash. I don't think that's actually what it's called. But it's the same thing as Double Dash. I, I never played it before. I'm going to try it. I don't remember if we did... I think we did Double Dash on stream once. I think we had Sandy over for that. Or something. Hello. This is Zalrog solo with no signal. The stream. There it is. Continuing my playthrough of the Crash series with a game that I have never played. Actually, this is the first Crash game I have never played. In the main line. There, there are some handheld ones I haven't played. But, uh... How loud is this? I need to see how loud this is. That sounded loud. Cool loading screen. Oh, is that that wasn't Coco, was it? No, it wasn't. It was a different character. Okay, don't mind me, just like just... watch the cool intro. I'm still uh Testing all, all audio levels. I'm going to turn the game down just a little bit. There we go. Something like that. A little lower. Okay. So, like I was saying, I've been playing through the Crash games, and I've played most of the originals, up to Twin Sanity. I recently completed. And I rented Twin Sanity as a kid. I never owned it. This one I have never played. I'm completely blind to this game. And I'm told that, uh... It includes some kind of platforming elements in addition to the racing, which sounds very strange to me, but I'll give it a shot. Memory card slot one. So each save slot for this game has five files on it. Interesting. This is another, like Twin Sanity, I, I knew this was another game that had the Spiral Mouth soundtrack. They were still doing that. I think these were the only two. I don't know if Spiral Mouth is still doing soundtracks for, uh... What's the one after this? There's Mind Over Mutant and there's Crash of the Tit Titans. I think Mutant was first. I, I don't remember. I get them confused all the time. Connect to PSP. Nope, don't need that. Alright, well, single player, here we go. Driving HUD. Auto-reject clashing. Is this like the, uh... Is this like in Mario Kart 8? When you have the anti-grav and you bump into each other and you both get a speed boost? Mind Over Mutant came first, okay. Hello, Darian. Crash doing his uh, best sexy pose. 
Hasn't really changed at all in design up until now. Top of the morning and the cock -a -doodle -doo sports fans. Hello Chick again, Cohen. It's to just the it's the twins. Race at Von Clutch's Motor World. That's right, Chick Baby. On what might be the final day of operation, Von Clutch will surely now, have that? to turn out the lights on his lifelong dream. Von Clutch, the deranged genius cyborg, has fabricated the ultimate auto racing theme park. Indeed. The park's tracks have wreaked terror on its participants. Too gruesome for this reporter to describe over the air. Quentin Flynn has well, a very distinct I voice. I got a problem with it. Man, you ever put a big ham in a wood chipper? I know I have. <clears throat> oh, sorry. But now old Von Clutch's power gems have been stolen. Giving Von Clutch just a few hours to get his power gems back. Oh, it's slam dunk. Thank you, punk. Ebenezer Von Clutch is now risking his park ownership in a Hello, Mango. no holds barred race. Race contestants must survive a gauntlet of each of the park's five lands and recover every one of the power gems that have been stolen. So they tried to mash this together with a traditional crash game, it seems like. There's a, there's a robo engine. <laughs> it's only a matter of time before we do away with these meddlesome rodents forever. <laughs> oh, yes. Pasadena, so is she his niece or his daughter? Time left before I'm Kaputsky. We must find more races. Is there no dumb cast among you to accept the challenge of the greatest race of all time? So, I'm, I'm confused. This guy's gonna lose his park if he doesn't get the gems. How is that our problem? Well, sports fans, it appears we found our dumb cast. I'm, I'm not okay, following this story. To walk or run, simply move the left analog stick or press the directional buttons in the direction you want Crash to move. Go ahead. Oh, okay. I, I, I never would have figured that out. Uh, Quentin Flynn has a very distinct voice. I'm, I'm really curious what he sounds like as uh, Raiden in Metal Gear Revengeance. Because I pretty universally know him as these goofy characters Small objects might require as cone and crash to get over. Now bit rolls button and let's see you do just a single jump come on feel it baby Ow! wow that's a long spin animation that's like three times the length of the regular crash games also I cannot slide yet crash one death animation all right interesting crash voice Uh, what else was I saying? Crash's design hasn't really changed at all by this point. It's still basically the same as it ever was. Whereas Coco is changing every single game by now. She has once again gained a new design. Obstacles or distances require you to do your Since, first uh... double jump to overcome them. Okay, How thanks. Exciting. Press the X button and then press it while still in the air to perform. I'm trying to talk, but I can't talk because Cone won't shut press the fuck the up. Button. You know, bumper coins are scattered everywhere, and even inside certain objects. Do they talk Collect this much the whole game? And spend it like crazy on new stuff. Bling bling. Coco's getting a, getting a new design every single game at this point. She had one for uh I think she was still fairly normal in uh, Wrath of Cortex. Then was a new design for Nitro Kart, another one for Twin Sanity, a new one for this game, and she'll have a new one next game. Yo, yo! Activation buttons require you to body slam to trigger it. Thank you. Press that X button, then press that circle button while still in the air to do a body. It's, it's weird collecting coins in a crash game. It doesn't feel right. This game was developed by the same guys as Simpsons Hit and Run. Interesting. Also, I saw one of, uh... One of Von Clutch's 
team characters. Are you ready? Crash is able to hang off edges. No kidding. While hanging, move the left analog stick or press the directional buttons to edge shimmy left and right. Press the X button to move we off got, the edge. Do we gotta do the Mr. Try T it. thing it's though? We already ball. did that to crunch. Okay. You've reached your first ladder. Somebody get a picture. To climb a ladder, press the X button to jump on and then press I'm it. Again I'm just gonna get through the tutorial quickly so that I can talk without being interrupted, is the oh, idea. This place is a dump. Sometimes the floor will just give way under you. Play safe. Okay, you gonna love this. Jump pads allow Crash to jump to otherwise inaccessible locations. To do it, press the X button to jump onto a All right, boys, we're gonna need you to come into the studio. You're gonna have to record 30 minutes of dialogue for people who've never played a platforming game before. What is the meaning of this? Have you any idea of with whom you are dealing? Several when did Engine become a zombie? Your periwinkle cortex. I have all your games. <laughs> for a moment there, I think all is lost for one clutch. But when I see my favorite video heroes, my innards tingle with joy. Well, tingle all you want. More fourth I wall. I have an appointment with world domination. <laughs> I need more races to recover my power gems. Whoever is first to bring all the power gems, what? the ownership of my bark. And look, even my beloved black power gem is gone. Perhaps this is the answer to our dilemma. This strange theme park is fertile ground for us to plant a new seed of evil. Yes. A new sinister base, all the churros we can eat, and rid ourselves of the bandicoots all at the same time! Not so fast. I'm Pasadena Opossum. I'm racing for Old Von Clutch, and I'm gonna whoop you, that's for sure. So, if I win, you'll hand over Can't the tell to the voice filtered or not. No questions asked? Perhaps a riddle or two! Holy cannoli! What is that thing? Ah, oh, that's my trolley pack mascot, Willy Wumper Cheeks. Okay, Von Clutch, we're in. Where do we start? Hilly hi ho to the statue you must go. This way or that, fall down, you go splat, and everyone thinks you're a schmo. <laughs> I guess that is the same Coco model from uh, Twin Sanity, isn't it? This is a very strange and confusing game. Well, something, something, power gems, crates. What a tortured existence this thing looks like. Hey, Pally, you look banjo speak. Uh, what was I going to say? Smarter kids, minor idiots. Is that just is this just all the NPCs in this game have wacky one liners? Can you believe how much the souvenirs cost? Oh the 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 banjo noises are crashed. That took me a second. Person. I don't think there's that was Jimmy Neutron. This family vacation is like so bad. I totally want to sell my children. <laughs> ah, ah, funny. Oh, that was a child, not a coin. Whoops. I think I lost the two. Hey! 
See that fine ride over there? When, when do I race in this racing game? Crash can perform special tasks around the world and unlock new vehicles. Man, can you see me in a couple of hens cruising in one of those? Woo! That, uh, that possum girl. You, you can't have a new character who is, like, blonde with a ponytail and wears blue clothes. That's too close to Coco. What are you doing? I really thought that was like a new Coco design at first glance. Also, Crash has never been able to hang before. This is a, this is a new thing. Oh, I guess I'm going here. What it, what is I, what is the ticking? Wumpa whip. Ahoy, mateys! Batten down your hatches and swap my poop deck, says I. <laughs> Avast, Excuse me. Swabs. Salty adventure awaits ye beyond these cursed portals of doom. <laughs> it's like Thank it's you, gay Mr. Willy Wonka is what he's yes, trying to go friends, for with the voice. Booty awaits you in this our first and here's Quentin Flynn church. again. Thrill to the terrors of and more walking. Okay. I I've talked before about some games that try to do too many things and end up not doing any of them well as a result. It's not amazing platforming, the way this controls. Time for some new threads, you baby. Talk to people selling clothes. Do, do I need new clothes? It means they have an outfit for sale. Press the triangle button to talk to them. Hey, yo, Crash Bandicoot. It's the vacuum hey, from Teletubbies. Hey, listen, I got a deal for you. Yesterday, some adventurer schmuck thought he could race the track and find the missing power gem. Oh, well, there ain't much left of him except these slightly used adventurer ducks. Hey, <laughs> I'd uh, give them to you. But I got little gas masks to feed. Oh, and the suit won't cost you a treasure. Get it? The, the cutscene ate my whip. My classic crash. Oh, sure. Yeah, I'll take it. Hey there. Classic what? what we got here now. That's not classic crash. Price, get it? That's fucking you, that's Casey. crocodile hunter crash. There's nothing classic about that, it's totally new. Classic crash. I thought it was gonna make him all look like uh, polygonal and shit. Oh, that's a lot of that's a lot of modes. I, I guess I'll race. Put bonus to coins. I, I, I don't care. I'm just trying to get through this quickly, so I can play as Cortex in the race, but not on the overworld. This was before Crash was mad nostalgia bait. I guess so, yeah. How successful was this game compared to other Crash games? Had it started its uh, descent of popularity yet? Or was that not until the next ones? I have the music for this track. This is the only, uh, this is now the only CTTR track. Press the X button to accelerate. On I have downloaded. Vehicle, use the left analog stick or directional buttons to Am I in a... Go ahead. You'll be bloated with control. I'm in like a, a fat motorcycle? Oh man, this is the cool yo, Flash. baby. Two vehicles can merge together during a race. While close to another vehicle, press the triangle button. 
press the triangle button again to separate. If somebody wants to clash with you, but you're not down with that, press the triangle. Hey, sports fan, let me introduce you to the Joy's Bump Power Slider. You can use okay, it to squares drift, that's an odd choice. Power sliding also gives you a small speed burst. Nifty, huh? Tap. What? What happened? I'm so confused. Tell some blonde jokes. You'll feel better. I. Uh, clash. Huh? What is this mechanic? This isn't double dash. This isn't double dash at all. Hey man, that turret you Thank you. Tired. If you want to shoot a different turret gun, press the square button to swap turrets. Happy hunting. Uh So I just I just tag on to someone. You can do either with the swap move, baby. Press the R1 button to swap places between the driver and the gunner. Is is this my goal? Make up their mind. I, 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 it, is it just my team has to win the race? Any member of it? It doesn't have to be me. This is very confusing. Oh, you get a little boost when you unclash from someone. This is extremely different from the previous two crash games. Previous two racers. Hey, hey! After collecting a weapon or special power-up item, press the circle button to use it. Now play safe, punk. Why, why am I so slow? Also, what the fu- I press square to do the power slide, and I just stop. I turn 90 degrees, and I stop. I guess I'll clash. The best way to play this game is to let the AI play it for you. I, I hit Coco. I'm not understanding the HUD. Is someone... Oh, I'm attached to someone. I didn't even realize I was attached to someone. Crash just got called a two-timer. Guess I'll drop the thing. Is that someone's targeting me? Is that what's happening? It's like the clashing is the only way to, to succeed at the game. You're too slow on your own. not a pick up and play game. There's a lot of there's a lot of stuff I don't understand happening. It seems like everyone just goes faster than me. So the only way for me to compete is to be clashed to someone and thus go like 3 times as fast as I do on my own. have to body slam to defeat ninja penguins it's the only way Un okay i unlocked another track now sports fan when Crash. You hunt by crystal, good and cheap, like new, but not 
use very little. You give me coins, I give to you. It is Henry Killinger. He has become a, he has become a vacuum from Teletubbies. He's a masked person. That was a very Henry Killinger voice. So all the people in this forest are just wearing gas mask like devices. I'm, I'm gonna be honest, first impressions of this game are very not positive. I said I wasn't gonna do a full playthrough of uh, Crash Nitro Kart. And I didn't, but I did play all the levels. I got to the main non-100% ending. I think just uh, I think just testing the water is enough for this game. I don't think I don't think I'm gonna do more after today. I guess that's what I was doing. I didn't. I didn't even know that's what I was doing. It just happened. Cool. Did Kojima direct this game? It's 80% speech and cutscenes. And most of the actual gameplay is you not playing the game. It's you letting someone else drive for you. Hello? Oh, it's you, Crash. Look, Did this, uh, do you know anything about the development here, of this game, Darian? Was this churros. similarly troubled? To like to Insanity was? Around, but I can't because my head's too big. I mean, look at me. I stick out like a chocolate bar in a swimming pool. If I'm going to get to the bottom of this... It's I funny because it looks like poop. That's the joke. It's a poop joke. Did you get it? I don't want my butt to look so big. Ah, he said butt. That's funny. Butts are funny. I'm sorry I'm being mean to your childhood. All right now. You need eight you think power. you're gonna get in here for free? Okay. Yeah. Thank you, Funky Chicken. This thing requires power crystals. Go get yourself the right amount to access and come back and try again. Freeloader. Hey, buddy. I wonder if you the voice for actor for that chicken crystal? is actually black. I found this the other day. No, oh, if you get what I mean. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, I, know. I found it. It's mine now. It wasn't before. Look at me. I'm winking. I don't recall seeing anything <laughs> that would make it in a quick development Bring cycle. Bring me a mess of coins and it's yours. Now, huh? You see that cheapskate Von Clutch? Tell him he should pay his workers better. Ten years of graduate school to have to dress this bad at work. I think that is again Quentin Flynn. I think he was the skunk in Twin Sanity, in addition to the twins. He just I guess that's just what he was doing for a while, was a lot of crash bit rolls. I mean to say nothing suggests it was rushed. In the game itself, or just in, like, uh, stories about the game's development. Okay, this is a battle arena. Which means I will just, I guess, clash with someone else. And, uh, pray is my plan. I don't have any other carts besides this weird, fat, three-wheeled thing. Hello, Penta. I'm assuming that's Penta. No one really talks about this one at all, honestly. Is that better or worse to be a... Uh, to be a bad game or a forgettable game? Oh, you lucky dog! Welcome to the granddaddy of all demolition. 
battle with other clashed cars. So I'm with Coco. No, I'm with Cortex. Why am I with Cortex? That doesn't make any sense. Now, Twisted Metal could get away with this. It would be interesting to see a tag team Twisted Metal game. Where, where does it show me the weapons I have? Okay. What, what's that supposed to mean? About Cal what are you saying about California? I mean, I don't live there, but it sounded like something unflattering. I guess I died. Where's my ammo? Is the yellow bar my ammo? There's a whole lot of tutorial, but not for any of the stuff that matters. It's just Southern Coco is that character. I'm not understanding why I can fire sometimes and not others. I'm, I'm not seeing the ammo anywhere or a cooldown. The yellow appears to be Cortex's driving speed. And I'm guessing the green and blue is like our health. I can't swap we swap weapons anymore. You stay away. I'm bringing doom. Am I out of ammo? I top right. Myself. Okay. What what is the top right corner showing me? Is the wump of my weapon? Jimmy Neutron. And how, how do I tell my ammo for said weapon? Or when it's on cooldown? I'm not understanding that part. The Wumpa Fruit is infinite. And I just have to just feel out when I can use it and when I can't. I do not have... I, I guess Cortex needs to pick up other weapons. See, I'm mashing X and it's just not firing most of the time. Coco is just sounding more and more Jimmy Neutron across these games. Until she kind of pulls it back in Insane Trilogy. Well, Cortex is not picking up other weapons, and I don't know how to make him to do make him do so. And I'm just my strategy is just to continue hitting X and hope that sometimes maybe, maybe like one tenth of the time it'll fire a fruit, which it does not seem to be firing anything anymore. It's not just not firing. Period. Okay, I can switch. I found the switch button. Now I am driving. And Cortex is having no problem having Wumpa Fruit at all times. You have to re-clash with them to fill ammo. But we're already clashed. Me and Cortex are together. Could we clash, like, four together? Is that a thing? Also cannot stop boosting once I start. Turning radius is not great. Oh, I blew up. So 
So the leader has seven. I don't know who the leader is because it doesn't tell me that. So I don't really know who to go for. And I'm down again. Here is like healing, right? The wrench, is that what that is? I'm just kind of driving in circles, getting wrenches as much as I can. You have to unclash and then reclash. Oh, okay. I thought we were just permanently clashed for the arena. Crystals are hidden around the world, and several of them may be needed to access important landmarks. That said, what may you need to access important landmarks? Right up. What's the... Well, might as well see the dying animation, since that's what they spent the most time on in this game, is the uh, cutscenes. And he just... It's just crash one death. Okay. Why do they need to, like, uh, flash? Can't they just, like, get squashed? Like, Looney Tunes style? Definitely had more satisfying enemy deaths in, uh, original Crash games. Hello, bird. I was in the arena, yes. Collect the chickens for time... Huh? No, I don't want to collect chickens. That sounds not fun. Oh, I can't grab that. Diorama. There's there's a best a bestiary for the deaths in this game. Oh, so I shouldn't have skipped that. That was a unique one. Collect the chickens. How many, how many chickens are... Oh, holy crap, that's a lot of chickens. That is many cook. Who let the cocks out? Oh, that's bouncy. Those are metal crates. Crates are tiny in this game. They're way smaller than Crash. That looks like a thing over there that I want to do at some point. They're, they're everywhere. There's no rhyme or reason to these chickens. Penguins are really not threats. They just kind of... Like, take ten seconds before they even initiate an attack. They're just there. Which is the best kind of enemies, the ones that are not a threat and are not satisfying to kill. That's exactly the combination of things you want in your video game enemies. No! Okay, well, chickens aren't happening. Collect all the chickens. There's gotta be like a hundred chickens! Whose idea was this chicken minigame? And why chickens? I like chickens, Eddie. Uh, th those are almost like go-go cages. I missed a jump there, and I'm dead. But that doesn't interrupt the chicken challenge. Uh... 
I wonder if voices crash in this game. It does not sound like his usual voice. Oh, that's not walk onable. That's invisible. This is just Precursor Legacy. No, that was more uh, Crash Twin Sanity. Was like a shitty Precursor Legacy. This is... I don't know what this is. This this is a cluster cluck. This is a game trying to be lots of things and, in my opinion, failing at all of them. It's got uh, not so great platforming without the slide. The Arguably the most fun part of Crash's movement. I have failed the chicken challenge. And that's... Aha! Uh -huh, people are gonna die. That's funny. Wait, when when did Crash become so lowbrow? I mean, I, that's a rhetorical question. I, I know when. It, it's, been, it's been a gradual process that I have uh, recounted over the course of the many games. Animal f Skeet Shoot. I, is this the thing, the shooting gallery? Jess Harnell. Oh, okay. It was, uh... It was one guy doing all the voices in the Crash 1 game. And I believe he continued to be Crash for a while. The guy from Crash 1. Animal Farm Frenzy Skeet Shoot. Earn points by moving the shooting targets. Bonus points for accuracy. Game ends when 10 targets hit the ground. Do I need to clash and unclash for ammo in this one? And they explode into meat. There's some uh, auto aiming. I believe this is a uh, like eight bit isk, eight bit ish remix of. Uh, Tiki Turbo. There's like a little bit of a Pirates of the Caribbean in parts of this track. Or of Tiki Turbo, rather. Lots of kids' cartoon roles. I believe it. Any, uh, any standouts? Hello? Why am I moving that? Okay. I guess I'll go over to see what that purple thing is. And dead. I know you don't love Precursor Legacy. I like Precursor Legacy. It's not one of my favorite games, but I do enjoy playing it. It is a good platformer. I would not call this or Twin Sanity good platformers. Th this especially. Twin Sanity was extremely unfinished. And I think it was a more coherent game than this. Which leads me to believe that maybe even if they had given the time to complete Twin Sanity it might not have made that much difference if this was what they came up with with a completed game. Brendan O'Brien. That's that's the guy who is uh, OG Crash. I think he was he, I think he was Embryo multiple times, but he was only Cortex in the one game. Did I do this course yet? What is this? Course 2. Driving games. Pirates of the Carburetor. I get it. Let's try Cortex. Because why not? There's a race car. I, I don't know what the... I guess that's the default weapon that shows. Because Crash has the Wumpas.
YouTube has a new feature for uh, labeling videos in chapters. I think this one will be pretty easy. The first five minutes okay, are the uh, the optimism. Five minutes to ten minutes, the realization. Ten minutes for the remainder of the stream, suffering. So as I understand what people have told me from this I'm game, sure Charles, the best way to play this game is to not play it. You attach yourself to other racers, and you just you just become their turret. You're not allies. No one will ever take this from me. No one. You're just you're just piggybacking on the AI. But it's the only way I can move uh, move fast enough. Is the music in this really quiet or what? I tried to I, I tried to tweak the audio levels at the start of the stream so that the game should be just a little bit more quiet than me. Is it is it really really quiet? Let's see if maybe I can turn the music specifically up a little bit. Everything's at max. Oh, this is like a lobbing weapon. Music's fine. Music's the best part of this game. Aramaki? first, so now I'll just... I guess this will test our theory. I haven't even completed the first race. I got in fourth place. Well, you even respawn still connected. Music seems kind of bleh. Eh. I like, I, I like acapella stuff. This is a... a a little, a bit too silly at times. I agree with that, but... I, can, I like Spiral Mouth in small doses. The sound design of the hole is, yeah, it's not, not amazing. The direction of this game is, I mean, I've talked about the Crash series on the whole for the entire duration I played it. Insofar oh, as, uh... Well, I can't catch up with him to Clash, so, uh... So I'm holding X. I'm holding my Go button as fast as I can go, and it's just, it's not very fast. Also, the circle button seems to apply to both items and boost, and I can only boost if uh, I have no items and full blue. Am I? No, I was in second. Sound design is just a hodgepodge of cartoon stock sound effects, pretty much. It's a lot of low-hanging fruit, is this era in Crash. He didn't fall as far as Sonic, but it's, it's still, it's hard to see. Can't wait to play Sonic Forces. Get to hear people make weird fetish jokes about Sonic's feet. Yeah! So I have heard. So that's two races now that uh, I have played on the easiest difficulty and not been able to complete. I mean, I guess maybe second is good enough. I, do I need first? 
I need to, like, get gems or something. And I don't know if I have any yet. I have three crystals. Are, are those the right crystals? Are those the ones I need? I got your thing already. I guess I should, should try Tiki Turbo. We have not played any uh, Jack and Daxter games on the channel yet. <clears throat> I guess if we did, that would probably be something that uh, I would play and Jack would be on commentary for. I think Jack uh, had a mild interest in Jack 2 and on, but was not really blown away by Precursor Legacy. Tag on to the... No? Oh, I, I can't start the race holding, uh, holding X. God, I'm slow! Crash sucks! Is that Nina's voice? I thought... Does Nina talk? has gotten lower. And he started doing like some uh, weird S and M bit starting in this game. Perhaps you need a speed boost. <laughs> yes, I do. You. You are my speed boost. Get in first, engine. Drifting seems to not be a thing in this game. The couple times I tried it, I just dead stopped. I turned 90 degrees and stopped. And I don't see the... the AI generally doing it. That's a... did I just throw a nuclear submarine? I'm sorry. Okay, I'm, I am now clashed with Cortex. So does this count as first, is the question. This is only lap two of three. Oh, I have the, I have the sub weapon, I guess. Get it, sub weapon? Haha, <laughs> funny. I seem to be out of ammo. <laughs> I have 47, but I can rarely shoot them. I'm not understanding how the cooldown on the Wumpa gun works. It just, it doesn't fire most of the time. I did it. I piggybacked on someone. Who was I even with? Cortex came in first. What a strange anti-competitive mechanic. I'm pretty sure even the Mario Kart devs would look at the Clash mechanic and wonder what the hell they were thinking.
Well, I got two of the... I got two things. I got two races if second place was good enough for the other one. Where am I going? I have five crystals, and I don't know if that's enough for anything. There's something up there. Can I get up there? There's also a dude with something over here. What, are, what have you got? Spend... Not sure. That's like a, a dark power crystal. It's corrupted by Naraku. Now, I retire to Fabulous Island and never return to this trash heap country. <laughs> Whether to put your granny in soap bubbles, you call that space program? I laugh. <laughs> you put your granny in soap bubbles. You call that a space program. Oh, okay. I did, I did answer your question, if you're talking about the Precursor Legacy. We have not played it on this channel. Which is inten intending to at some point. So it could still happen. It'll probably be me playing in Jack on commentary. So how do I get, how do I get up there again? There's Clothes Guy. Oh, that's a... Uh, I guess there was a trampoline I hit. I'm trying to reason how I can possibly get up there. Sit from here? No. It's like a big circuit, is what it looks like. Ow! Did you just step on my toe? Uh, around the outside? Why do I why am I losing a jump doing that? I'd rather I'd rather tolerate the bad platforming than I would tolerate the bad racing. Uh, probably Shadow is gonna come sooner. We've been putting off Shadow for a little while, but it's on our list of things to start soon. Is the plan? Trying to sneak around in forbidden areas, but can't because of your huge head and bright yellow skin. It, it, it's Ringo Scar. He's orange, not yellow. Are you blind? Or is someone you know trying to? Huh. Well, then, do I have a treat for you? Park Technologies oh, is selling the latest in urban spyware, the Ninja Matic 3000. Right, you can buy it for barely two pets. Whatever those are. Okay. So we gotta get the thing. Neo Foo. Hey, good stuff, lad. With this, your yellow skinned friend will be sneaking around to his little heart's content. Perhaps he'll even reward you for your troubles. But probably not. Thank you. All extra costumes will be toast! 
Here we go. Here's the, the weight of the thing, I think. Oh, that's a big jump. I don't like that jump. I'm going to fall from that jump, and I'm going to do all this over again. Okay, I made it. Good. That's almost, that's about as shitty as the fanfare we're getting for items in uh, Majora Randomized. What, what is that square? Huh? Oh. Quick time event. Ah, he died. Funny. So now I gotta find Cortex again, wherever he is. I'm so very lost. There's a map, but there's nothing on the map. There's just icons. Which I guess icons are something, but having an actual map with the shape of the land would also be nice. The background music gets very uh, feel good ink for a second. Vortex, where are you? I don't remember where you are. Is this a death? Yep. Probably Majora this weekend. I do, I am eager to finish it. Or eager to uh, continue it. Hoping, hoping finish it in one more stream. We'll have to see. But uh, Jack's been working, so. Uh... Is this gonna kill me? No, this is the thing that this kills them. Where the hell is Cortex? I'm so lost. You're balloon guy. No, this is the this is the mini game. I, I already did this. There's probably more to do, but I don't want to do more. I think that's Cortex up there. Okay, I see him. I need to get there. Somehow. Water wheel. Lava. Penguins. Now this is nice. I can go He's got a sword. This little number. Whoever is behind all this won't know what hit them. Oh, and take this power crystal. I found it in a dumpster covered in that disgusting wumpa whip. So I don't want to keep it. Thanks. I want to spend eight crystals to unlock the mystery island jump pad. Do I need to... Is, is that important? Oh, okay. This is one of the, the crystal thingies I need. It's funny. Do you get that reference? It's referencing a thing that you should get, because you've seen the thing it's referencing. Coins and Wumpa stuff re okay, why? What does getting the crystal have to do with that? Just, I guess, opportunities to get more stuff. Okay, so there's another level in here. We have discovered level three. And another outfit. Excuse me, dear fellow. I seem to have found this rather sinister evil crash outfit. I would never use it, as it's not part of my character. Besides, it doesn't fit in the derriere. It's a vaguely Q, vaguely James Bond. You, boy. For mere what the fuck is up with Cortex? He just sounds like an absolute pansy. You remember how in Family Guy Season 1, Su uh, Susie, Stewie was like, uh, evil genius, had lots of crazy science, wanted to kill Lois, and then they decided it would be funnier if he was just a gay stereotype. Yeah. That, that, that happened. That, that's Cortex. He got to be intimidating for one game, Crash 2. 
he got to be cool bad guy, and then after that, it was all downhill. As the series just got stupider and sillier, and but just all comedy. Very low hanging fruit comedy. I no, I'm not gonna do Crash. Crash fucking sucks. Crash's vehicle is awful. It has no speed to it. Oh, Brian. I say, let's go get the Bandicoot. Alright, level three. How's this gonna go? Spooky underwater music. Vaguely, uh... The tunnels sound kind of like, uh, the Star Wars sound. They remind me of Episode One Racer tracks. I, I guess that's Nina's voice. Okay. Who voices Nina in this game? Using explosive rounds on my niece, by the way. That's Cortex. Well, I guess, no, I'm Crash. No, I'm Cortex. I'm with my niece. The daughter? I don't know. This game is weird. Shotgun? Stock sound effects. Quick time event in the middle of your racetrack. I knew I shouldn't have tossed that bus transfer. Reminds me what happened with SpongeBob. Yeah, sure. Amy Gross. I, I guess that's a fitting name for a Nina actress. Now you know who the real I've been playing the uh, Spyro Reignited trilogy. And now my, like, uh, my crosshair logic is all messed up. Because that doesn't let you invert the crosshair. Just up is up and down is down. As opposed to the usual, like, uh, pilot controls. That was a cow. Why am I throwing ca explosive cows? What is this, worms? Oh, how excellent. This isn't a racing game, it's a shooter game. This is a, this is a rail shooter. This really makes me appreciate how good Jack X is. Jack X is great. It's a great racing game. Even Nitro Kart was doing. Was... I enjoyed it. I had a good time with Crash Nitro Kart. This one. No. 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 You see? I knew that extra quarter oil would work. Okay, that was necessary. It's funny, because bodily noises. Primarily known for her Winx Club roles. Oh, okay. I wonder if that's the same, uh... Same studio as, like, uh, the Bleach crew. I, I feel like I remember hearing some other voices besides just Quentin Flynn in the Twin Sanity. I, I don't remember for sure, though. And I don't remember who does the Bleach dub. Or did. It was like an NYV post. That was a wasted sub. The sub weapon. This crystal in my special place. No! Who let the canine Ex out? Uh, woof, uh, huh? Woof, woof. Huh? Begin quivering with excitement. Brian! I'm hiding something in my ass, Brian!
Don't let Activision know you said that. They'll shut you down. Didn't, didn't I guess Activision's MO is like uh, games that play themselves these days. Isn't that how they're doing their shooters? Like quick time event, quick time event, illusion of danger. Sneak up on the boss and shoot him. Isn't that like every Call of Duty final boss or something? But how, how get through? Have I hit this button yet? Maybe that's how get through. Well, that's how I get through there. This is gonna kill me. How's this gonna kill me? Rock falls on him? No, of course not. That would be too predictable. It's a monkey with TNT. That's so wacky and random. Bet you weren't expecting that. Are your expectations subverted yet? So were you... Were, were you hoping that I would, like, unironically enjoy this game? Or were you kind of expecting this to go, like, two hours of me just shitting on it? Darian. Oh, that's already act. I can't activate it twice. Something opened. Is this the other, uh... Yeah, it's the other, other one opened. Is this gonna kill me? Probably not, no. Just penguins. And a cannon. Fire the pirate ship. We're doing a lot of damage to this guy's theme park, which is just a theme park. There's no actual threatening or historical artifacts here. So there, there's a new path. Deep sea driving secret short. Uh, is that on a track? Oh, that's not. That's. Okay, so I did something on the overworld that affected one of the race tracks and opened a shortcut. That's interesting. I don't know how exactly that translates into multiplayer, but uh, it's interesting, I guess. So... What? Oh, Cortex is here. He's a madman. Can't stop, won't stop. Okay, he'll stop. Why crash Bandicoot, my old friend? Have you ever heard the Cortex proverb that revenge is a dish best served with fava beans? Because well, farts. Why play terrible game when you can play fun terrible game? Are you implying Shadow the Hedgehog? Because my experience with that was that it was just very boring and forgettable. I'll give it another shot, but it wasn't a great first experience with that game, either. It's kind of expecting a so bad it's good reaction. I, well, I'm amazed that this game exists and that they said it was complete and put it on the store shelves and some people apparently liked it. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I think this is one of the worst things I've played on this stream. I've played DOS games, I've played some Flash games, I've played lots of hentai. This is down there. Oh, I hate this. Where am I going? What am I doing next? I have... I, th I think I need to find my way back out to the overworld. Because I have the, the, the crystal, the gem. Now if I could just do that. Oh, that's the probably the, the home, the house sign. 
the midway. I'm sorry. That's the the hub, not the hub world. The midway. What do midway games make? I can never remember. Apparently, I learned today that uh, totally unrelated to anything I was just talking about. Uh, my battery is running. Hold on. Oh, I didn't. Sorry about that. My laptop has been unplugged for like three hours now. Ugh. I learned today that uh, apparently there was a Drew Carey show episode that involved Sim City as a paid promotion. And they like went into like a little virtual city. Which sounds extremely bizarre for what I thought I knew about the Drew Carey show. I imagined it as a slightly more whimsical Frasier, but perhaps I was off the money. Oh, hey, Coco. Oh, Crash, thank goodness you're here! I've been trying to get this car working, but that stupid know-it-all know-nothing Nina stole my fusion unit. You've got to get it back for me. This car will be the best thing ever! And stuff. Sport and race games? Oh, okay. Oh, hello, old man. So they're just... They're just humans walking around. Is this your lawn? Mortal Kombat Rampage. Okay. They look... They look a little bit like Ratchet and Clank alien children. Like, they're suppo mostly supposed to be human, but... They don't fully look human. They look like alien humans. I'm your daddy. Child abuse is not okay. Yes, Mr. Crash. Okay, seriously though, why the fuck is Engine a zombie? Aren't you? You like to listen to propositions from Engine. I need a plutonium fuel cell for my new vehicle. Find me enough beautiful plutonium, and I will reward you with many fine coins. It's like when a manga artist doesn't establish a color scheme for a character. So early promotional art just gets the character's colors totally different than they end up being in the anime. That's Enjin. Enjin is the promotional art version. Before they realized he was supposed to be white with orange hair. Oh, hello. Of course, that's what the black guy sounds like. They kind of look like uh, like Roller Coaster Tycoon Three people. This is the worst theme park I have ever seen all my life. Or like people from a shitty Wii shovelware game. That's what the human models in this game look like. Oh, hey, cutie! You ever seen me driving on those tracks there? Boy, I Whoa. tell you, I am the meanest thing on the streets. And if you thought that was something, wait till you see me driving this hog around. Trouble is, I needs me a power crystal to get her started. You don't got one, do you? I needs me a power crystal. Damn. I'll be revengeified for that. Okay. Her voice cracks a lot, that actress. Well, Crunch is working out. Let's hear his Mr. T. Come on, Crunch. Don't disappoint. Crash. Up, Pose. Yeah, Enough jibber jabber. I need help. I found a ride that needs driving. You gonna help me? We bring the hurt. Eat your greens. Float old crunch alone. Low interest. I buy that ride and word. We bounce. It's not even a good Mr. T impression. 
We have to we have to buy Crunch. He won't work for free. I'm gonna be on it. Well, I am. Is he gonna die from photos? Okay, that was, that was a cool, very necessary sequence. Well, I'm I'm enjoying a, as shitty and juvenile as, as it is. I'm I'm enjoying walking around and beating up children more than I'm enjoying playing the game, if that accounts for anything. What's this? Another shooting mini game? Crit or clobber? Clobber. Clobber carnage. PTSD is setting in. There's a lot of these shoot mini games. I sounded like Cleveland Brown. Oh, Darian, that's nasty. Earn points by shooting the moving targets. What is this track? This was in Twin Sanity. This was the Twin Sanity title theme. Oh, no, I keep expecting it to be inverted, and it's not. Or rather, it's... I expect it to not be inverted, and it is. Insane has ruined me. What am I firing? Other poultry? Am I firing foul at foul? What do you think about these, uh... These... Uh, gamey versions of the songs, Charles, without the goofy voices in them. When does this end? Fifty coins, thanks, man. I already did the photo booth. What's here? This is like a, a turtle carousel. Man, I remember when I was in a platformer, running through a jungle, killing turtles. It was my thing. It was unique. No other platforming heroes kill turtles. Okay, see you later, Charles. Two weeks a year vacation, and I'm spending it here. ruined his ice cream. He's got clown makeup on. This child is a is a child clown. Is he a child? He sounds like a grown man. She keeps hitting me. Jimmy Neutron? Sucks. Thanks, Jimmy. I agree. I think I lost the tooth. You're watching. 
Uh, so I need to, I guess, find Nina for her thing that she took from Coco. I also know it's a thing that Coco calls Engine cute in this game, which is probably the most bizarre thing in this game. Hello? You gonna serve me? What do you got? Popcorn? Kettle corn? I like kettle corn. He's gonna walk to the edge of the thing, but he's not gonna talk to me. Chicken strong. Uh, where's Nina? And what's the other thing? An engine wanted something. I, who cares? I don't. I don't. I don't know what he wanted. Like fusion, something or other. Stewy technology. Cortex and Engine's Road to the Multiverse. Welcome, everyone! In this wondrous land of enchantment, contestants test their mettle against the putrid forces of darkness. Race through the track of the beanstalk, once upon a tire, and the ruthless evilosity. Then test your wits on the Stunt Arena Challenge. Man, I okay. sure hope that stinking beauty gonna be as fine and shapely as she is in the storybooks. I second that emotion. So Three tracks, one arena per world. After me. I do believe in stinking beauty. I do believe in stinking beauty. I stinking do. beauty. This game establishes that Crash is a monster. He was so nice in Crash Nitro Kart too. He was such a like- he, for the first time, I'd mentioned it in that game, that was the game that made him, like, the most likable character. It was the best Crash, was Crash Nitro Kart. Guy's having a bad time, he just lost a race, Crash gives him his yo-yo, he's a cool dude. I like Nitro Crash. Oh, that's death. I guess that'll open a shortcut on some track, right? <clears throat> so what was that boulder? Just nothing? Unnecessary? Doesn't matter? Where did I land? What happened? What do you got? You got a crystal, crystal to sell? Sale. What's your wacky impression? Okay. 50 salemen, that's your voice. Well, here you go, Mr. Man. One stolen power crystal for use by you wherever and whatever you feel like. Okay, as for me, just forget we ever talked, okay? It's just every NPC is a different overdone impression, which I am not a per one to talk about overdone impressions, but come on now. Hello? Hey, you in? And then he has to go to the bathroom because it's poison. Poop's funny. A 
It's just random cutscenes scattered about everywhere. It's not a game, it's like they were trying to make an interactive cartoon. And it's a bad one. Oh, this is, it's like Bubsy. Tickle the ivories? Ovaries? Was that was that a sex pun? I don't I don't know, quite know what the joke was there. If not that. Can't see. I can't spin the coins away like a good Wumpa Fruit. Even though the spinning away of the Wumpa Fruit was a better bit than most of the things in this game. Oh, there's a crystal. What's your offer? What do you what do you have for hey, me? Hey, fella, thanks for coming by. You gonna buy something? Come on, I need this. My wife is gonna leave me if you don't buy something from me. How many mistresses do you have? It's an AI you, dungeon reference. Thank you so much. You have no idea how much I needed this. I lost a bundle buying internet stock. Then, I don't know, being an evil henchman seemed like a good idea. He's an evil henchman? Oh, is, is Von... What's his name? Von Clutch? Is he supposed to be an evil park owner? It just kind of seemed like he was in, like, like dire business straits. And for no reason, we're here helping him. I, I still don't understand the established urgency of why Crash and Company are involved in this plot. Oh. The costume, I see a crystal <laughs> hey, up there. You're that Crush Bandicooter fella, ain't you? Well, I got a little something for that. Oh, we're doing thing. a southern noise now. This here pink ballerina number is perfect for any man or mutant, and I'll let it go for a very reasonable mutant. price. Engine ballerina. As tempting as that is, I'm good. Wait, huh? Wait, did I get the crystal from that? From spinning up there? That's uh, that's a cool hitbox. I didn't even need to get up there. I I can't quite get get up there. Can I go up there? I don't know if I can get over there yet. Can I get on that bridge? I cannot seem to reach that bridge. That might be closed off until I do a track. No, I'm good. I'm fine. I can get there. These are some demanding... Not very forgiving platforming jumps for a game with not so great platforming. Like, they really expect you to take some risks, and if you fuck up, then you're just gonna have to climb the entire level all over again. Come out. No? Does it disappear if I get close? Is that what's going on? Or do I need to complete a track before that'll come out? Don't I don't want to look for chickens. That doesn't sound like a good time. 
I already went that way. I guess I... I'm really trying to avoid having to do the, the actual levels, the races. I might be out of other stuff I can do, though. Why, why penguins? Why are they here? Why are there ninja penguins in this man's theme park? And then the, Thermina the Terminator thumbs up. No? Okay. Alright, well, on to the level. What's this track look like? This track I won't be playing, because I'll be, uh... What are these other types? Fast Lap, Run and Gun, ACDC, Crashinator. So all of these have gems or crystals available. the equivalent of avoiding the spider house. Except I know if I were to complete this game, I would have to do all of these, probably, I think. I guess I'll look at the other game types. I need 40... 40 for gold, whatever that is. 40 crates, I'm guessing? I have to collect crates the need, on the track? The need for acceleration. Or, in this case, frogs. So I need to drive the track and I need to hit hit everything. It's a good thing I go so slow. Oh, missed one. You don't even... You're not even required to get all of them for gold. I think it only asks for 40. Maybe I should have done Crash for this, because he is slower. Linear, fairly easy. I guess I'm cool with that. I don't have to do three laps of this. I'm getting everything on the first lap. These are also pretty long tracks, I would say. I always was the best student at Evil Medical School. I guess after this, I'm gonna have to, uh... Well, that that was that was easy. That's way more doable than whatever the stupid race turret mode is. I guess I'm gonna have to either look into emulating or else track down a copy of uh, Mind Over Mutant after this. Shouldn't, which shouldn't be that hard. There's usually, uh... For the games that uh, no one really wants, they're pretty easy to find at the local game store. Now, good games. Good luck finding those. Those sell out. Those sell immediately. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna look at the other game modes besides the race. What is Rolling Thunder? I'm glad the uh, Nitro Fueled brings, like, the characters and scenarios from this game into the CTR engine, which is a much better racing game engine. Wait, what? Crunch, go, move. Okay, so this is, this is arena, except on a racetrack.
This is just kill everyone. So sorry. Not Well, I'm, I'm good, good at killing things, I guess. Especially if I have infinite ammo with a weapon that actually fires when I press the button. Then it, then it works great. Maybe a hint they're not remaking CTTR. I would imagine not. Or CNK. CNK was very similar to a CTR. It didn't really introduce any new major mechanics or anything. It was just kind of, it was just CTR, but more. funny because people are dying. My twin sanity is the only one I don't know about because there are, according to you, people who want it remade, but got a lot of problems we found. And how much of those problems do you keep in the game? How much do you just make it a whole new game? We have this discussion every time we talk about it. Twin Sanity being remade. It's a, it's a really complex issue that I don't know if they're going to want to address or if they're just... Uh, they're just going to keep their hands off it. What are some other uh, famously unfinished games? I mean, Miyamoto always said that he considered Mario World unfinished, but... I don't necessarily get that feeling from it. It's not unpolished, like Twin Sanity was. Run and gun, 25. Wait, oh, oh so I'm Nina, I'm the gunner. What What am I gunning, these things? Give it me your rich innards. Innards? Enter the Dragonfly to use a remake. Yeah. Open says me. It was Enter the Dragonfly was unplayable mostly because of the the controls. It was the engine that made it bad, not necessarily the ideas behind the game and level design and such. So if it were on the original, if it was the same content on the original Spyro engine, it could work. I, I, that's my assumption. I never actually played enough of Enter the Dragonfly because of the shitty engine to really know if there's anything worth saving in that game. There was another game after Enter the Dragonfly with a Hero's Tale. There were two in that PS2 set before they started the the realistic Spyro trilogy. Spyro 06, as I call it. So I guess this is Nina's default weapon, is the shotgun. Maybe. I didn't get gold. Oh, I did get gold. Okay, great. All of the game modes other than the one that the game was designed for are better than the game mode that the game was designed for. So the only other one is Time Attack, which is... You can probably guess what that is. How forgiving is it? Because this doesn't seem like a game that is made with uh, high-skill competitive racing in mind. 
This is more like attempting to be a party game. Without success. You, uh... Somehow find a way for me and Jack to do Crash Boom Bang. The, uh... I think that was the... Failed attempt at a Crash Bash sequel. The second Crash Party game. On, uh, the Nintendo DS? It had some, among other things, it had some very strange graphic decisions. I don't actually remember if it was ported or if it was if it was uh, only in certain regions. I'm also glad Yaya Panda is in uh, Nitro Fueled, despite her model in Nitro Fueled looking kind of weird. She looked like a neat new character. To spawn from the Crash Racing mobile games, but doomed because she was from the Crash Racing mobile games. Definitely get Pod Racer vibes from that uh, track split. It's a new lap record! specifically boost my speed, or... I'm just kind of holding X and turning. I have more fun with the skeet shooting than the racing. Again, trying to do way too much. They're trying to make too many different kinds of games. They're trying to be a jack-of-all-trades, and I, I guess they succeed being a jack-of-all-trades, because they're definitely not a master of any of them in this game. Why'd they remove the slide, though? That was the best part of playing Crash. Oh, come on, I didn't even fall in. Where am I going? Did something open? I didn't even see. I need to, like, pop that platform out before I can go up that way. Is it out? No, it's still, it's still in. Do not touch. Can I touch? Is there, like, a death if I touch? It's not. It's just an arbitrary yellow sign. No! Alright, where am I going? Oh, come on. I can, I can go on the outhouse roof. Nothing? Okay. Well, I can get engine a tutu here. I don't know why I would do that. How is that not a special death? Just an arbitrary well there. Is there anywhere else I can go besides another racetrack? Anywhere at all. Been down there already. This looks like a, a new death. Maybe. No? This is something I would expect to be in a Bubsy game, is looking for new ways to die. That, that was... Well, I guess Crash also had that thing where the death animations were, uh, wacky and unique. And they could do that as a mechanic, like a, a, a log of all the death animations you've collected, but this is, this is just way too forced, the way they do it in this one. It insists upon itself. The death animations insist upon themselves. There's a new place. Well, that's another track or an arena or something. There's lots of buttons I can press. Let's press all the buttons. Let's be DD. Man, if I got some smoking threads for you, check out this freaking dicky. It's all secret agent and stuff. 
give me some of that fine coin, player, I'll give you these fine duds. You dig? Player. Agent Crash. I don't need I don't need a Agent Crash. I'm fine without him. Alright, go up there. Here's a dude with a crystal. Crash guy, right? well, uh, you're, you're looking for power crystals? Will uh, I, I kind of owe a lot of money to some uh, some people right now. So oh, gee, I'm Rick! To sell this crystal, they're gonna take my thumbs. Please buy this from me, please. <laughs> Morty, you, you got you gotta get inside this suit, Morty. You, you gotta look like a vacuum cleaner. Oh, you gotta talk to this bandicoot. Sell him a crystal, Morty! You have no idea how much I need this right now. Take this stupid crystal, it's yours. I'm going to get a pizza. Uh, good job, Morty. Now I won't have to take your thumbs. <sighs> Hardly ever land stunt arena. Let's see what a stunt arena is. I like how every door leads to every arena or every racetrack. You can just do any of them from anywhere. Uh, I probably don't want Crash for a stunt arena. This is a Crash game wherein I avoid playing as Crash as much as possible. Is this like a is this like a points thing? Do I have to do tricks? Cause that sounds awful. Test all of your fancy moves here in the stunt arena. You can perform a series of stunts to win more Wumpa coins. Hope your pants yeah. have insurance. I bore easily. It, it was the implication. Attention, flight passengers. To maintain some vehicle. Was the implication that I would shit myself? Analog stick and the right analog sticks. To control the car it's, yeah. in the air. And remember, your it's... seat cushion can be used as a flotation device. Ah! It's My it's car. the skate park from Spyro, but shittier. Because it's in a fucking car, and cars were not designed to be skate park vehicles. Oh now who put that there? Who's your daddy? At least I can't bail like I can in Spyro, it seems. Nice no. Characters talk a lot in this game. of the race much. I guess I'm just doing flips. This is about what tricks amounted to in the Spyro version. Down boy, steady. No, I love there weren't any special like feet movements or anything, it was just all flips. Such power, such speed, I'm quite a catch. Double flip. I just watch this vehicle. How am I going to talk my way out of this one? I you get a lot of time for this. Is this the price of victory? Just driving around. Fairly mundane arena, doing flips, flippy flips, all same flippy flips. I got like three flips I can do, I'm just gonna do them 20 times each. 
feel the need, the need for acceleration. Mad scientist coming through. Well, I got the gold. I don't know why I'm still going. I still got two full minutes left. The music is not helping at this point. Burn, baby, burn! Like a disco inferno! Ouch, ouch, and double ouches! Shit his pants? Was was that what was said? No, oh, the humanity. Yeah, this timer's a little bit long. I don't I don't know if I need to be in this level for this long. I don't need to I don't know that this level needs to exist. This is not fun. I don't like this flipping the car slowly, repetitively. While we're at it, I'm not sure this game needs to exist. Can we undo this? Can we get a different crash game? No, I love this car. Not my baby. My baby. All right, hundred. There we go, 100. That, that was for bronze? Nice skin box. Great. I just watched this vehicle. Maybe, maybe I'm not quite understanding if that was just for I bronze. Just love when that happens. 150,000. Nope. No thank you. Cortex can't make one move without saying something. That's that's a trademark of uh, games focusing maybe a little too much on aesthetic and not gameplay. No, that was a uh, that was a big complaint with the Mario Game Boy Advance remakes, the ones where every character had to say something with every single action. Dropped on Jin, falling target. Oh, okay, again shooting better than the racing. Protect the genies. Oh, look, look, look at them. Pretty sexy, right? Parachuting dynamite monkeys. It's a sexy looking sphinx, too. And I'm firing bananas. Oh, I have to shoot the dynamite, too. I thought the dynamite would only come attached to the monkeys. Stock monkey sounds. Are they bananas I'm firing, or boomerangs? They might be boomerangs. Maybe they're banana rangs. These are what the harem looks like in the Babar Empire. These, these are the elephant maidens 
that Babar's father, as king of the elephants, keeps in his palace. Oh, I got one back. So do I already have gold? Like, this control's more or less okay. This could be like, uh, this could be a mini game in uh, another Crash Party game. Oh yeah, there's yeah, definitely still a one-off stream. I'm, I'm just, I'm killing time until I hit two hours, which I just did hit two hours. So, probably not going to continue much past this mini game. Probably about to call it. Oh, the monkeys are dropping the dynamites. How much longer does this go? Should I just let them get them? You don't win. You just do a little better each time. That was great. Like, this is way easier to succeed at than the stunt track I was just doing. I don't know if I could get gold on that one if I really tried. recently that the uh, cover of Witch Doctor in the Rugrats movie that was sung by the the monkeys not the band the monkeys but actual monkeys in the in the plot of the movie the Rugrats movie was uh, performed by Devo which makes sense because you know Mark Mothersbaugh was the composer for the Rugrats soundtrack him being a I think the founding member of Devo Still a very strange, very, you know, kitty pandering cover, of course. I'll do a little more exploring of the overworld, see if there's anything of note that I can unlock before I call it. Or if I fall to the bottom again, then uh, I think that's a good, good place to stop. How do I get up there? Do it from here. Does not appear to be able to do. Man, a first person like camera would be great. That's okay, I made that. So I need to get up there. In order to get across there. And just hop on spiders all the way. There's a lot of pathing in this game. I never did hit all these buttons. buttons. Oh, so that opened that way up. If there's anything I know about ninjas, it's that they're slow. I, I guess that did something. <laughs> C 
So wacky. Never before done. Uh, how do I get it there? Hmm. There's a whole path over there. I'm gonna need to be able to get access to eventually. Here's number three. Does it want me to climb on these crates? Am I supposed to be able to do that? Is this... I think this is like a, a bonus area if you climb on the crates. Look at all these coins I'm not going to be using because I'm about to end this game. I'm going to get Crash set to retire so he never has to make another shitty game again. And then he's going to spend it all in Vegas and waste it. And he's going to have to do Mind Over Mutant. I should have climbed on those. I shouldn't have destroyed those. I can't get up now. Shit. Good uh, camera getting stuck in the geometry there. Nope. Oh well. I would like to get up those moving stones that I unlocked, because I never got to go over there. I would like to do that before stopping. It's a wonkivator. It goes up ways, sideways, in ways, and out ways. All which ways. Uh, right, let's go this way. Like we tried to before. Come on, come out for me. I'm feeling some weird momentum on these platforms. Is this an elevator? This is. It's a moving platform anyway. Oh no, I gotta do hanging parkour. I don't want to do hanging stuff. And I missed. And I gotta wait for it to come back. I'm gonna get over there. You just why? I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Do this sequence that I wasn't able to do before. I'm going to get that crystal. That crystal's the end of the stream. Random fart. Okay. You see the momentum. I like, I jump off and I'm still moving. this momentum system was tested because it's pretty bad uh hmm well huh can't move left I cannot jump ah oh, well, I'm back on the thing but now it's going back can I make it I made it all right now where am I going Is that it? I can't go anywhere from here? Can I... I can't make it to that. Oh, I can. Okay. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna make it. Thanks for watching. I'm done. No more. I'm not going to play that anymore. I'm done I'm done with Crash Team Team Tag Team Racing Crash Double Dash. I, I, I don't feel the need.
to go back to that game. I think I'm good. I'll give Mind Over Mutant a chance, because I think that is at least a platformer. I mean, this was also a platformer, but it was a really bad platformer, so maybe, maybe, maybe they'll do a little better if it's a game that's meant to be a platformer. Maybe it's not a platformer. I don't even know. But I'm gonna try. I'm gonna find it and I'm gonna try it. So that'll be somewhere down the line. His mind over mutant crashed. It just pet a chicken and then he kicked it. You didn't see that. All right. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.